you've ever wondered how Taylor Swift has managed to sing and dance her way through a three-hour set list for 66 separate shows during her month-spanning era's tour without completely breaking down, wonder no longer, the queen herself just told us. In a new interview with Time magazine, in which Swift was named the publication's 2023 Person of the Year, the songstress opened up about all of the preparation that went into building her stamina for the monstrous 180-minute show which she says was harder than anything I'd ever done before by a long shot. While the first singer joked that she used to tour like a frat guy in years past, she then revealed that her Irish training began six months before the tour show kicked off in Glendale, Arizona, in March 2023. Every day, I would run on the treadmill, singing the entire set list out loud. Fast for fast songs, and a jog or a fast walk for slow songs, she said noting that her gym also crafted her a workout plan. Then, I had three months of dance training, because I wanted to get it in my bones. I wanted to be so over-rehearsed that I could be silly with the fans, and not lose my train of thought. Learning choreography is not my strong suit. Swift also revealed that she gave up drinking while working on the tour, aside from a boozy and hilarious night at the 2023 Grammys, because duh, adding, doing that show with a hangover. I don't want to know that world. As for how she chooses to recover after a weekend full of shows, I do not leave my bed except to get food and take it back to my bed and eat it there, she told the publication. It's a dream scenario. I can barely speak, because I've been singing for three shows straight. Every time I take a step, my feet go crunch, crunch, crunch from dancing in heels.